Hello and welcome to CHDK. I'll be your host, ADC, in trying to install CHDK on your Canon camera. It might be a little tricky at first, however with this video and a few helpful tools, it can be a piece of cake. So let's install CHDK. Alright, so first, you take a regular SD memory card and place it into a card reader. SD memory card, card reader, place it in. Your memory card reader might be located on your computer. It can be a USB card reader. All it has to be is a card reader. Okay, now you take your card reader and you place it into your computer in the USB port. Now, you should see something like this show up. Just close it by pressing X. Now let's download card tricks. Just go to download card tricks on the wiki. This should bring you to SourceForge. You will get a pop-up saying, do you want to save the file? You click save file. Now it should start downloading on the bottom. Once it finishes downloading, go to Tools, Downloads, and a box should pop up. Now double click on the file that you just downloaded, click OK, Run, and Card Tricks opens up in a new window. Now you should have Card Tricks open on your screen. Click on the little postage stamp of the SD card. Now, select the drive letter of your SD card. This would usually be the last letter on the list, for example, G. And then click OK. Now, these are the details of your SD card. Do they look familiar? They should. If they're not, you chose the wrong card. Now click Format as FAT. Click OK, click OK again, and now it should start formatting as FAT16. Now this can take a long, long while. You can even check the progress in a command prompt tab, which should open up next to the card tricks. Let me move it into view. Now as you can see, it might take an extremely long time to format especially if you have a large 4 gigabyte card. So just let it run until it finishes. As you can see from the command prompt window, it is almost finished formatting. On my computer, this took around 10 minutes. However, depending on the size of your card, it might have taken 1 minute, it might have taken 30 seconds, it might have taken an hour. But now, it's finished formatting. After it finishes formatting, the little formatting message should disappear, you click Make Bootable. Click OK. And that's it for preparation of the card, at least. Now it's time to download a build of CHDK for your camera, so click on the download link. This will bring you to the downloads page for all of the builds. This page is a bit confusing to navigate, however, here is an easy way to find your camera. Just press Ctrl F on your keyboard, and this should bring up a little find toolbar on the bottom. Now type the name of your camera. For example, I have a Canon S5IS. So I would type something like S5. Now, it would show Ixus 55. That is not my camera, so click Next. Next again. Next again. Ah, there it is. The Canon S5 IS. Now, below it is another build. Canon S5 IS. Firmware version 1.01B. Now, 
I suggest to always download the latest one. So let's click on S5 version 1.01b. This will start the download. So click Save File and OK. So now it should finish downloading. Click Tools, Downloads, there is your file. Now remember where you saved this. Generally, Firefox saved this to the desktop. However, you might set it to be something else. For example, I set it to be a downloads folder on my desktop. All right, let's go back to card tricks and let's find our CHDK build. Click on CHDK to card. Now it should open up a download location. For example, on XP computers, it's usually desktop. On Vista, it's usually your home folder, for example, ADZ, or whatever your username is, and downloads. Now, the build will appear somewhere as a zip file. It should contain your build and your Canon model, for example, S5IS. Just double click on it. It'll finish unzipping. And that's it. That's all you have.